What it do, man? It's your boy Battle Truth coming to you live and direct from the Battle Truth headquarters. I want to read something to you people. Takashi 69 was indicted on federal charges of racketeering and the RICO law. For people who don't know what that is, I'm just going to read a little bit of what the RICO law is and, and racketeering. It's a racketeer, racketeer, influence and corrupt organizations act commonly referred to as the RICO Act, or simply RICO, is a United States federal law that provides for extended criminal penalties in a civil case or action of acts performed as part of an ongoing criminal organization. Okay? Siri, give me information on the RICO law. Okay. Check it out. Hold on. Siri, I need information about the federal RICO law. Okay. I found this on the web for I need information about the federal RICO and law. What is the federal penalty of the RICO law? Here's what I found on the web for what is the federal penalty of the RICO law. Right. Federal definition of the RICO law. Here's what I found on the web for federal definition of a RICO law. They saying RICO law. The cough drops. I guess I'm not saying it right. Siri, what is the federal definition of the RICO law? Man, this lady ain't smart. This lady dumb as hell. Siri, what is the federal definition of the RICO law? Here's what I found on the web for Siri. What is the federal definition of the RICO law? And the federal definition of racketeering. Racketeering means dishonest and fraudulent business dealings. Right. So basically this way he's charged with. Him and his team, a criminal activity, a criminal organization. This would this law was put in play for gangs and mobs that make uh, that's doing criminal transaction and business and laundering and finance and laundering money and things like this. We seen days before this indictment that he remember he came out and was like, everybody who was working uh, up under me, I fired them all. Ain't nobody under me no more. So if people booking y'all events and all this stuff, getting y'all money, that's not me. If you don't hear from me myself, don't accept it because they robbing y'all. Because we're seeing all these uh, allegations of these people, his booking agency now was booking all these events and shows for him. He was only getting a third of the money. They were pocketing like three millions of dollars and things like that. Well, the feds believe that it's more to the story than just that. And maybe he had a, a, a part parts in it and just trying to clean and cover himself up however it happened whoever gave him a tip on what went what was supposed to happen he went public saying things like he was firing everybody and and, and, and put and was going to handle business himself only because word probably got around that this indictment was here and they came and picked him up now the thing about this stuff is i seen one time the Treyway dude sitting in a car and he called the bank. And these brothers just show off so bad and the bank reading his financial statement and it's like $22 million in the bank. See, see, what's crazy is we know a lot of these young brothers who get all this money, 
They don't know nothing about paying taxes. They don't even think they even care about paying taxes, man. They'll sit here and gloat, showboat, show off over these girls and try to flag money on guys to make themselves look bigger than them and things like that. So many of these brothers is already getting indicted, already under indictments. Everybody is on these things live and just talking crazy. Vlad is asking questions about how much you're getting paid for your liquor, how much you paid for your chain, how much you paid for your house and your car. All these setups that brothers just ignorantly speak about having no idea of what they saying incriminating themselves man and I wouldn't doubt that the whole hip hop industry is not up under indictment right now the only thing about it is some take longer than others because it's more players involved than others you get what I'm saying and I wouldn't doubt it when you're seeing all these brothers from Lil Boosie to Young Boy NBA to Rallo and to Kodak Black and Yo Gotti and Kevin Gates and them. All these brothers coming on the internet just exposing and just, just, just telling us everything just to make themselves look good and look bad and to try to get a hit and sell a record. We know who y'all shooters is. We know you putting bags on people's head. We know that you uh 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 stealing people jewelry and setting people up to get robbed and all this stuff that y'all think y'all could just freely say on the internet as though these people out here ain't about politics. What I mean about politics? A lot of these brothers are ignorant to politics. The government that we live under is politics. These people run for office. Your sheriff run for office. Your alderman run for office. Your mayor run for office. Your state's attorney run for office. The judges run for office. Everybody get voted in. Everything, everybody get voted in. And the number one weapon of use where you decide who your representative is going to be is punishing sin. Punishing sin. That's why you see these commercials like when such and such was in office, crime went up this high. Sexual offenders was up this high. Drug use went up this high. Murder rate went up this high. We need to get them out of office, and I promise you, I do. See, that's their number one weapon and rule of choice. Criminal organization and activity. So thinking you're going to be on this internet just talking about how you uh, 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 terrorize people, how you extort and rob people, how you got all the shooters and all the money lined up for you, how you robbing venues and things. You are self-admitting racketeering, RICO law, extortion, attempt murder, all these things. And they don't even really need witnesses because you're admitting it out of your own mouth. And where we getting the word conspiracy from? So I'm not surprised that 6 9 them incarceration it is. These dudes ain't never really experienced nothing before. And you know what I see that's so sad on all these young dudes? They don't have that older father figure or older person that that that, that holds them accountable or that 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 they respect to keep them out of doing this type of stuff. You got just a lot of young people with a lot of money living like cowboys and Indians and don't think that nothing is nothing is real. Nothing is real. And they just setting themselves up for failure. We saw XX Sakashian get get killed on camera. Now we're seeing uh, uh, Takashi 6 9 federal indictment, Rallo federal indictment, ARF federal indictment, um, young boy NBA on, on, on uh, Bell fighting Hitler shooting case thing. It just, y'all just don't get it, man. Y'all letting the money and fame go to y'all head. You starting these rivalries and all this feuding for no reason at all. And nobody can't tell y'all nothing. Because you think because you got money that you are in control, and you not. And then when the government come in, it's really over. If this brother fighting a federal charge, they already got evidence on him, or they wouldn't even came and got him. When that indictment was set up with Takashi 6 9 name on it, 
Man, that was already sealed. That's already sealed. That's why they came and got him. They're not going to play with brothers like him who got money. So when they come in and get brothers like him who got money, they know they got to come correct because if they don't, they're going to have a lawsuit on their head. So they're not going to play them games because they know them brothers got money and they're going to get top lawyers and all that stuff. But let me tell you something. You can't pay your way out of the government. The government the one that make the money. The government is the one that make the money. So having money don't really get you off the hook like that. I told you how crime go. The more money you get, the less have, the more or less of time you may have to a certain degree. If you ain't got no money, that's the more time you're gonna get. That's why when you look at crime, they always say yo, 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 your crime consists of this much prison time and this much of a, a financial fine. That's how that goes. You understand what I'm saying? So Brothers and sisters got to get it together, man. That brother nine times out of ten, I don't wish this on him, but if you out there doing that type of stuff and you your brother just out there shifty, y'all doing dirty things, setting each other up. You laying down with his ex-girlfriend to try to make yourself look bad when he uh look better than him when he break up with his girl. Now you calling his girl on the line and you want to take pictures laying up with his girl. You know how stupid that make you look when you do that type of stuff? I wish a person would take a picture with a girl I had laid up with. You think that make you look good? When I done bust all in this girl face and she done swallowed and deep throat me and now you sitting here drinking a milkshake out the same cup as her. <laughs> yeah, put put them on tape if you want to. Yeah, this battle troop girl. Sure is. Let me show you what she been doing. <laughs> right. Man, you brothers silly, man. Y'all foolish, man. Grow the hell up. Grow the hell up. Then you surround yourself around other fools. None of y'all can control each other. Everybody just wacko and just all for they self. Come on, man. You brothers, you brothers setting y'all self up. Can't nobody tell y'all nothing, man. Can't nobody tell y'all nothing at all. You going to prison, uh... Takashi 6 9 I ain't gonna drop no federal case against you. Since when? They don't do that. You going to prison. You can try to uh, 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 trick and tell all, all the people. Yeah, I'm firing my staff and all that stuff. You know, if y'all, if they've been getting money from y'all and all that, that was not me. Oh, well, the feds think it was. The feds think it was. So all that talking, y'all, y'all must have got tipped off. They'd be like, man, they got y'all up on the racketeering and the RICO law. That's criminal organization, mob action, gang action, laundering and extortion of money and fraudulent and fraudulent and bad dealings. All, all that stuff tied to that, man. Going to prison. They got my brother and them up under that stuff, too. Add them up under the RICO law. Real talk, man. Criminal organization. Those are laws that was implemented to uh, govern the mob. To keep the mob them in line. That's what they be getting them on. And now y'all up under. All that bragging. All that money. All that shopping. <laughs> Brothers need to get it together, man. And this your boy Battle Truth. It ain't my judge from that's in question. It's yours. You got to get this phone. Subscribe to Battle Truth. Takashi 6 9 Treyway, and Crippy is arrested under federal charges. Of racketeering in the RICO law. Brothers need to get their minds right, man. All that tough stuff. Now you finna be humble. Now you finna be so quiet, so respectful. You should have been that way from the very beginning. Why do it take for you to lose your life and freedom in order for you to understand what's really important? And now why these brothers be crying, well, I want to be with my kids. I want to be with my daughter. Oh, I love you, babe. I want to get married. I should Now now you want to be with those who you've been taking, uh, who you ain't been taking, uh, who you ain't been taking serious. You know what I'm saying? Now you want to be with them. Come on, man. That's how this stuff go, man. Brothers need to stop being so damn dumb. Wake up and trust and believe in the Lord Jesus Christ. It ain't my judgment that's in question. It's yours. Subscribe to Battle Truth.